Hello everybody, welcome to my new video. Today's topic is the three biggest misconceptions in physics. So let's get straight into it. Number one, weight is the same as mass. It's easy to understand why many people use the word mass when they actually mean weight. Not many people fully understand what mass actually is. The Oxford Dictionary defines it as follows. Mass is a quantity of matter which a body contains as measured by its acceleration under a given force or by a force exerted on it by a gravitational field, which means nothing else than it's a property of matter that can be described by Newton's laws of motion. Weight is the force that acts upon a mass in a gravitational field. It is written Fg and is the product of the mass times the acceleration, which is in our case 9.81 meters per second squared, or g for short. So next time someone says, I weigh 20 kilos, he actually means the value of my mass is 20 because the actual weight would be approximately 20 times 10 which is 200 newtons. Number two, astronauts aboard the ISS are exposed to zero g. So someone might say the astronauts aboard the International Space Station are so far away from Earth and they're floating around, surely they must be exposed to zero g. Well, no. If the Earth was one meter in diameter, then the orbit of the International Space Station would only be one centimeter away from it, and gravity would still be 90% of the strength we experience here on the surface. Instead, astronauts experience microgravity. Astronauts are constantly falling around Earth, and as I explained in another video, there's always acceleration in a rotating movement. This movement appears like the astronauts are weightless and allows them to do some very cool tricks like this. Yep, I'm envious. Number three, the Big Bang must have been such an amazing event to watch. The Big Bang always gets depicted as this massive, bright and colorful explosion. But believe it or not, if you were there when the Big Bang occurred, you wouldn't have noticed a thing. The truth is that there wasn't any loud bang, nor was there even light. Back then the universe was so incredibly dense that photons couldn't even exist. The first light we can observe was created nearly 400,000 years after the Big Bang. That was it guys, I hope you liked this video. Please like, comment and subscribe and I highly recommend you to check out Veritasium's video about misconceptions about heat. Link in the description below.